These are dark days, I fear. Nothing wrong. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Duncan, I've decided to name you as my sentinel. I'm just worried about my family. The king was not inclined to offer help for your family. Are you willing to risk an alliance with the crown? It's a risk I'm willing to take, Lord Tyrion. Your mother asked me to cross the narrow sea to find your brother, Rasha. We don't want White Hill men within these walls. You can be my highborn ward. Ethan. No! Don't let them take me! Whoa, it's just me, Beska. Took you long enough. The rail's getting warm. Or warmer, I should say. You can stop pacing. This stuff is weak we'll compared to Northern Ale. Is that wine? Or blood? Taste it and find out. It's blood. Oh. <laughs> this place could use a good cleaning. I complained to the owner. Fragrant. Looks like we weren't the first to rough up the place. Nice having the place to ourselves, though. Only a forester brings his axe all the way to Essos. Wicked little thing, though. I know, I know. Woman sellsword. Four years fighting by your side and you still can't get over it. Come on, Asha. Quit staring. Let's get to drinking. Ale. It goes in yellow, comes out yellow. Waste time even drinking it, if you ask me. Considering we found it in an abandoned tavern, it's not bad. They smell off to you. It's the only thing in Yunkai that doesn't. I know. It's a filthy haven for thieves, murderers and other deadly bastards. You should feel right at home. I know I do. May we drink, thieve, and fight until the end. I'll drink to that. <laughs> You'll drink to anything. Another round? Have you forgotten about our honored and exalted guest? Go see if he's still breathing. How's he doing? We need him alive to collect his bounty. 
After that. Remind me again, what's this fat pig fucker's name? Bazak Zog. Something or other. Don't care, really. So long as we get our gold. Eight hundred gold dragons for capturing him. Lucky we caught him trying to flee Yunkai. Lucky for us. Not so lucky for him. We should find more former slave masters with bounties on their heads. I don't need any more naked fat men in my life, thank you. <laughs> they say only the poor know how to really spend money. We'll buy the finest wines, the best whores. Sleep in a bed without fleas? Sounds nice, doesn't it? We've not been paid yet, Beska. Can't spend dragons you don't have. We'll have them soon enough. My point is, with enough coin we could do anything. Go anywhere. I could afford passage back to Westeros. To Ironrath. I've heard nothing from my family in years. You mean go home? They treated you like shit there. Kicked you out because you fell in love with a girl from the wrong damn house. Gwyn. A man doesn't choose who he loves. Your family should understand that. Westeros and its bloody houses. Who fucking cares? They're still my family. My brothers and sisters. They had nothing to do with it. I suppose that's true. Just remember, we have a good thing here. And any moment now, we're gonna be rich. Let's make a toast. To all of us deadly bastards. To us. Aye, to us. Beske, I thought freed slaves put the bounty on Bazak. They did. With his own gold. So why are the fucking Lost Legion here? Oh, is that Tazal? From the Volantis job? Maybe he's forgotten about that. You! I told you if I saw you again! Tazal! Isn't it funny how life brings old friends together? I'd cut your fucking throats! It's good to see you too, Tazal. Where is he? Where's who? Here. Four hundred dragons. They must be working for the Wise Masters. And that's all you're getting. The bounty is eight hundred. You get four. It's more than you deserve. Give us 800 and you can have him. Don't be an asshole now. We're all sell swords here. We are nothing like you. The Lost Legion are the blood of all Valeria. And we are done taking orders from whimpering pigs. Bloody hell. And we're done with you too. Tazal, what the hell have you done? You two are going to be useful to me for once. Not bloody likely. The wise masters will hear how Asher Forrester kidnapped the venerable Bezak. How he wouldn't take less than 800 gold dragons. So he killed Bezak instead. Me? Luckily, we were there to deliver swift justice. So you steal the money and we get the blame. Ponteos in us! Bojos menomi jahosso kisikas! Alright, who dies first? Who wants to dance at the end of the season? Kill them! Now! Here's one! Come on! She couldn't pass me! You owe 
Show me one. Shit. This is for Volantis. Mister. This reminds me of <laughs> that brothel in Novos. You kill me, and the Lost Legion won't stop until you and your friend are dead. <laughs> their way. We need to go. Come on. Malcolm. Damn. We have to keep moving. Malcolm, stop. Asher, I'm glad I found you, my boy. It's been far too long. What are you doing here? Your brother Ethan sent me. I'm here to bring you home. That's far enough. I come from the twins bearing the dead of House Forrester. Lordly types from the looks of them. All right, we'll take them. Well, they're not free, are they? How much are you paying for them? Sir Royland. 
You again! Who have you got this time? Some poor peasant dressed up like a lord. A stable boy in Bannerman's clothes. You did this at Duckendale. And you have the fucking stones to try it again. No, I... This house has suffered the loss of many good men. And you dare come here claiming to have foreign leave. Now! Fine! I'll dump them in the river then! You come back here again, you won't be leaving. You got that? I, I heard you! That was a sheep fucker. I'm sorry, sir. I don't worry, you, sir. Seven hours. What is it, sir? This one's still alive. You there? Who are you? It's me. Roderick. Roderick? Roderick! By oh, the gods, it is you! Sir? Fetch the maester! Hurry! Fetch the maester! Roderick! Stubborn, my lord. Roderick! My lady! No. I am at a very delicate moment in the surgery. Please, I want to see my son. More. Don't. <sighs> Sir, my lady, I must <gasps> insist that you leave. No. Roderick, what have they done to you? These wounds would have killed any other man. As it is, he may never walk again. Roderick? <gasps> he refused the milk of the poppy. That's Roderick for you. Brave as always. But the pain must... Uh, Roderick! <gasps> Roderick! See you again. Roderick, thank the gods. Brother, I think oh, I lost fuck. you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. You're stronger than when I left. Two years is a long time. How bad is it? <laughs> Maester all Tengren says your leg may never fully heal. And your face. These wounds will heal, Talia. I know. You'll be your old self before we know it. Roderick, there's something you need to know. Ethan is dead. Ethan? Bruce Bolton's bastard came here and threatened to take me away. Ethan grabbed me. And that monster put a blade through his throat. Like it was nothing. Ethan. How could this happen to him? We'll make Ramsay pay for what he did. I promise. Good. We're planning to honor Ethan in the grove alongside father. And now mother wants me to write this song for the funeral. I can't. <laughs> Ha <laughs> 
You can, Dahlia. I know you can. <laughs> it's been chaos here since he died. We have White Hill soldiers stationed in our courtyard. Even the small folk don't feel safe. You need to show everyone who this house belongs to. They need a lord. You're still a hero to them. If you lead, others will follow. I know you still need time to heal, but... I'll be fine, Talia. The council's meeting in the Great Hall right now, actually. Nobody expects you there, but if you think you're ready... I want to go. Can you even stand? They could use your leadership. I guess we'll see. I missed you, brother. You can do this, Roderick. I know you can. Roderick! I'm fine. Why'd you do that? I won't let anyone see you like this. Not when the house appears so weak already. I don't care about that. Let them see me. But you're the lord of the house now. You must appear strong, solid. You can't do that on the floor. It's a long way to the Great Hall. We can't risk you falling where others can see. Take my hand. Let me help you. No. I have to do this on my own. All right. You're really doing it. Everyone will be so glad to see you up, though I think you'll find that much has changed. black, so this is the seat of the Night's Watch. The wall. Always wanted to see it. Recruits Not at the gate! for Frostfinger. On a horse, no less. Look 
looks like it was built by giants, doesn't it? You're new, here to take the black. Because mm. you got that look about you. Aye, I am. Thought so. I'm new here myself. Frostfinger, he's the one you want. Handles all new recruits. Which one's Frostfinger? That grizzled old prune over there. Says us new recruits are all dead men. But don't let him scare you. <laughs> That's just his way. You seem nice. That's not so good round here. What's in these barrels? It's pitch. Dump it off the wall and it'll burn the wildlings down to their fucking bones. Your Frostfinger? You recruits. You come, you train, you fight, you die. Who are you, boy? I'm Gary Tuttle, nephew to Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of Ironrath. Gary Tuttle of Ironrath? And how does a Castellan's nephew get himself sent to the war? You're a thief. A raper. You abandon your post. I killed the men who murdered my family. Then you know how to fight, at least. And you're no liar, either. Sir? From Duncan Tuttle, Castellan of House Forester. My uncle wrote to the Night's Watch. He goes on for a bit, but then he asks us to make you a ranger. As if it's a knighthood. So you see, Tuttle, I know all about you. You are a killer. Even if you are man enough to own up to it. Yes, sir. Now then, we'll start your training in the morning. For today, you need a cot and a cloak. Understood. Oh, and Tuttle, sooner or later, the Night's Watch will be your death. When it comes, try to make it quick. And last we'd heard, Asher was in Slaver's Bay. So, Malcolm caught a ship headed for... I heard they took him off a corpse cart. <laughs> and he's missing his arms and legs. <laughs> At least he can still eat his shit. The White Hill soldiers are drunk again. <laughs> and we have too few men to handle them. Let's just get to the Great Hall. Well, I say he's dead. And they've dressed up some peasant in his place. Fill me up, would you? And bring us some salted pork while you're at it. <laughs> Fill yourself up, you lazy fuck. Is that him? Has to be, doesn't it? He's hideous. <laughs> Had a run-in with Walder Frey, did you? I should have buried him with the corpses. Forest is Real cursed. shame about your leg. Who gives a toss? What? We have business in the Great Hall. <laughs> Go round. Get out of my way. I'm quite comfortable, thank you. And I don't think you're gonna make me. I 
wonder what's weaker. Your legs, or this house? I am the lord of this house. And you will move. It's ridiculous. You're treating them like the wine guests. keeps their wits dull. It makes us look weak. Both of you, please. So you'd rather they riot? Duncan, you're a damn fool sometimes. It doesn't matter what you think. I was chosen as sentinel. My lords. Roderick. My boy. Come, join us. Lady Talia, you should have told us the Lord needed help. Uh. <gasps> My Lord! It's good. Good to see you awake, Lord Roderick. We didn't expect you so soon. The Maester said it would be weeks before you were walking. If you walked again at all. It was highly probable. I'm not here to talk about my elf. Perhaps we should get started. Yes, let's. Dali has told me the state of our house. Then you know our situation is grim, my lord. No thanks to your sentinel. He's been getting the White Hill soldiers drunk. It keeps them off their guard. They think you're a bloody fool. My lords, please. Oh, oh, I'm a fool. At least I was there by Ethan's side when Ramsay stole. I've told you. I was keeping an eye on the Bolton soldiers. You should have been protecting your lord. Now Ethan's dead, and Ryan a hostage. I am your lord. Of course. Apologies, my lord. The White Hills have my brother. We fight amongst ourselves, when we should be fighting them. We'd need an army to win that fight. And we don't have one. Not anymore. Summon our allies, then. I'm afraid we have none left, my lord. We've heard little from the Glovers since the Ironborn took Deepwood Mott. Houses Helleva, Grayson and Brownbarrow were all slaughtered at the Twins. And the rest of our allies are terrified of the Boltons. You forget the Glenmores. You'd be wed to Elena Glenmore already, if not for the war. And her father is no coward. Now that you've returned, the marriage can proceed as planned. The marriage? Well, much has changed. The Glenmores may no longer desire the union. Lady Elena will decide for herself. Your betrothed is on her way here as we speak. Lady Elena? She's coming now! Why is she coming here? She means to pay her respects to your father. But it could also be a chance to solidify our arrangement. If she still wishes to marry, we'd have the allies we so desperately need. Their army would become oath-bound to Roderick. And we could burn High Point to the fucking ground! Yes, this marriage could be our chance. Of course, we must hope Lady Elena still wants to marry Roderick. We're talking about a marriage, not an Ironwood contract. I'll secure a father's army, no matter what it takes. Very good, my lord. Just be careful not to push Elena too hard. If Elena does come to Ironrath, she'll see those soldiers in the courtyard. We starve them out, and they'll have to leave. I'd rather they be lying around drunk than setting the stables on fire. My lord, perhaps you could put an end to this tiresome dispute. Let them go hungry. Yes, my lord. Now, if there's nothing more to discuss. 
Maester, it's time to light the ironwood torches. Yes, my lady. Welcome back, my lord. It's good to be back. Gregor last lit these torches when his mother passed. Ironwood doesn't burn easily, he told me. But foresters have a way. And now we light them for him and Ethan. How is your song coming? Ethan always helped me with music. It's not the same without him. I can help you with it. That's all right. The last time you sang, all the dogs in the kennel started howling. But thank you. Everyone knows how much Ethan meant to you. I'm sure it will honor him well. About Elena, I've sent a letter to Mira. The Tyrells hold much influence over the Glenmores. I don't know where things stand between her and Lady Marjorie, but maybe your sister can find a way to help. It's entirely ridiculous. If it's not the flowers, it's the food or the table settings. Is that the letter to the orphanage? Yes, my lady. It's nearly done. Make sure to tell them we'll send all the leftovers. And mm, something nice after that. We will make a sizable donation in the name of King Joffrey. A little presumptuous of you, Mira, but I like it. They'll be very grateful. I had to borrow that from father. Mine was stolen, can you imagine? I wonder who it was. Oh, are there any more invitations to send, or are we finally done with the cursed things? One more. An invitation to Sir Maynard. Ah, yes. One of my father's favorite drinking companions. I have a letter for Lady Mira Forrester. Thank you. My pleasure, Lady Mira. What is it, Mira? It's from my mother. She asks that I help ensure Roderick's betrothal to Elena Glenmore remain intact. How can you do that from a thousand leagues away? Ah, it's my help she's after, isn't it? She's a bold woman. Most would shy away from asking such things. Forgive my mother. She doesn't see the harm in what she does. She's not entirely wrong. A letter from me could encourage the Glenmores to honor the betrothal. But it wouldn't be very discreet you'd be forcing their hand. That isn't the way I do things. You pushed me before and you saw the results. I'm sure your brother can secure the marriage on his own. I'd better get going. Mira, we'll talk more later. If Lady Marjorie wrote a letter... Dear Lady Elena... No, dearest Lady Elena...
She took the seal with her. Luckily, I have this, Lady Marjorie's seal. Mira, Lady Marjorie sent me to pick up the letters. Elena of House Glenmore. I've never heard of the Glenmores. I know you're very busy with Lady Marjorie and... and all that's happening with your family. But I was hoping we could talk. If you don't mind. What about? Well... It's... We really should get these letters sent first. Do you need any help with those? I've got them. 